I scream, you scream, we all scream for an ice cream death match. Let's talk about that. Good mythical summer. The best part of summertime is that our beloved ice cream parlors can finally open their dusty windows which have been boarded up for the cold, long, sparse, disease-ridden winter and yell to the townspeople gloriously, ice cream is back! The ice cream is back! Winter didn't kill us and the ice cream is back! I love that classic summertime tradition. Everybody loves ice cream, but what is the best ice cream out there? We could debate our local favorites, but today we're finding out the best possible pint of ice cream you can buy in almost any grocery store. It's time for what pint of ice cream will make us say, yes, queen. Okay, we're gonna be tasting vanilla from each of the brands because we think it's the best across the board indicator of quality. Sorry, we don't make the rules. Actually, we, we do. And we're gonna be rating the ice cream on a scale of one to 10 and also guessing which brand we each think it is. At the end, the highest rated ice cream will be crowned the king of ice cream. And whoever guesses the most ice cream brands correctly between the two of us will be the ice cream king. Mm -hmm. And here are the brands we're going to be tasting. haagen mm. Ben and Jerry's, mm. Tillamook, Blue Bunny, Dryers, and Briars. Let's do this. Round one. As you can see, we can't. All of the ice cream will be served to us on the patent pending commune spoon. Let's bring in the commune spoon. Okay. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Is it open? Oh, oh, hey. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, where's the ice cream in your commune spoon? Uh, oh, so we're close. Be careful. I do not want to touch tongues with you, man. Hold on, where? <laughs> How much ice cream? They didn't put. Oh, oh, there's some over here too. Oh, oh, I got, I got, I got some ice cream. Oh, mm. Mm. now that is. That's some good ice cream. It tastes but good. I have nothing to compare it to. I think I got a little bit on my beard. <laughs> you um, know. I mean, not a lot. Oh but, yeah? Uh, just maybe just a tad. You know, I, I think it's great. I have nothing to compare it to. I will say it's more on the icy side than the creamy side. Um, I don't think I'm gonna have any insight into this at all because I very rarely get just straight vanilla ice cream. I, I like a good vanilla ice cream. And I haven't had I've had many of these. of these, but not all of them. And the thing about dryers and briars um, that I learned was that they're totally unrelated, named after totally different people. And I kind of thought that dryers was just some, some guy who broke off from briars and then wanted to thumb his nose. So I'm just gonna change one letter. How about dryers? It's drier. But they are totally separate is what my uh, research tells me. Well. And, and, and by the way, I, I guess I'm giving this a five just since it's the first one. Well, you always do that, um, so I'm gonna do it as well. <laughs> no, I, I, I'm giving it, uh, I'm gonna give this one a four, because it's a little low. It's just, it was, there's nothing really exciting about it. I mean, I know it's vanilla ice cream, but it didn't have a real richness to it. It no. was, I mean, no, it was I good, see, but more than not creamy. great. You ready to guess? Yeah. Yeah. Three, two, one. Dryers. dryers. Ooh. Oh, did you go with dryers? No, I said briars. You said, oh, no, no, it's not, definitely not briars. Buh, buh, buh. Round two. All right, bring it in. Mm -hmm. I understand how the commune spoon works now. There's ice cream. Um, what? Well, maybe I don't. Where? Oh! Oh, sorry. I did, think I might have just slingshotted it into your face. Did you move the spoon? Don't I, touch the spoon. Well, I was pushing down on the spoon. I had to just suck it out of the spoon. I'm gonna suck a ball of ice cream out of the spoon. You okay? Mm. Now mm. I immediately noticed that this ice cream. I got a lot. Oh! Oh, are you okay? I got a lot of ice cream. What, what have you noticed uh, about it? Because I'm noticing something immediately. It's cold. Okay, what else? It's better. Much better than the previous ice cream. Mm. So whatever that one was, this one is much better. Hmm. I'm saying, I went with a five before, Mm. Man, I'm gonna go with a, at least an eight for this one. It's It's got a hint of almost vanilla. Yeah, it's very, it's, it's much more vanilla-y. Yeah. Is oh. it, do you, do you have a hint of salt? A hint of salt? 
Yeah. Nope. <laughs> it is very good though. It's got a more complex flavor. I got a huge ball of it. Mm -hmm. uh, it was a, a little overwhelming. What number are you giving it? I'm gonna give it a seven. Okay. Uh, but what is it? I have a guess. Uh, mm, uh, okay, I okay. got a guess as well. Three, two, one. Blue Bunny. Mook. I almost went with Tillamook, but I haven't had that before, so there was no reason to. Me neither. Round three. Are they washing the spoon every time? Huh, I think it's a new commune spoon every time. Oh. Probably not. I just got chinned with some ice cream. Oh, that, no, that's just the, that's just the spoon. The spoon's just that cold. The spoon moves a lot. That's. And I don't know if that's you that's or the me. person holding it. That's the person holding it. There's a, there's a sharp end over here that keeps hitting me in the face, so I, I, I'd rather not get a, a fat lip. As well, a tell that to the guy holding the spoon. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> Hmm. Huh. Creamier. Much creamier, right? I was thinking icier. Well, the taste is creamier, but the consistency may very well be icier. It feels like it's got more air in it. Like it, somebody took a shortcut. And then, and now. Air? I'm getting, you know, they, they're, every. <clears throat> ice cream has a certain amount of air Can we bring in it the that spoon makes back it fluffy. In, please? Oh, the spoon wasn't even there. <laughs> And um, Dang, having a lot of spoon issues. Traditionally, the thicker the ice cream, the less air that's in it, the, the, it the nicer it is. It also has a slight, almost uh, fake vanilla flavor as, as an aftertaste. Did you notice that? No, I, but I do think it's definitely not as good as the last round. It's somewhere in between the two. So between a five and an eight is a what? Six and a half. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go with a six for this one. I'm going my, my, back down to a four. My it, rating. This one is as bad as the first one for me. Uh, but what is it? Uh, I honestly don't know. Okay. Wanna guess anyway? Yeah, I think we should guess anyway. <laughs> Three, two, one. Blue Tilla Bunny. Mm. Round four. I've never mm. Bring in the scooper. Never felt more lost. I just feel like I'm just throwing out random ice cream brand guesses with no indication as to what, there's no logic to it. Wow. This ice cream is totally different than any of the others. It's so much smoother. Oh, that's almost soft serve. I think I know what this is. I'm all over this one. Mm-hmm. I've, I've got the phone number, I'm dialing it up. Bring, bring. Let me get some more of that, that's good. You think it's the best? Where I, is it? I actually don't think it, I still think the second <sighs> one. I still haven't figured out my technique. <laughs> I feel like a baby who's learning how to eat. I put my lips on it and just suck. Like on a cow teat. Mm. There was an audible, ugh. Is this gross or something? This isn't gross. It's just two guys eating ice cream out of a big spoon. This one is so You've smooth. You've seen that before. Since it's the smoothest one, the consistency is top notch, but the taste is still not as good as my number eight, so I'm giving this one a seven. I am giving this one it doesn't have as much of a rich vanilla s nest to right, it. Right, right. But I think I gave the other one a seven. I give this one a, a six, because I do, I do, well no, you know, I'm gonna give it a seven as well because the consistency's better. Yeah, and I'm, I'm, I'm pretty much betting my farm on knowing this one. Really? Yep. Okay. Okay, three, two, one. Hagen ben and Jerry's. Ben and yeah. Jerry's is not that smooth, is oh, it? Well, it is, because that's Ben and Jerry's. Okay. Round five. Bring it in, bring it in. Okay. Oh, that, that, that makes me wanna go in. Making pig noises. That's a way to get your commune spoon buddy to get in there. Mmm. Mmm, that's a good ice cream. Dang. It oh, tastes exactly yeah. like the second ice cream. I can't, what? It tastes no different than like, that one. I feel like they're giving, they're, they're making yours higher or something. Mmm. Mm, there it is, I got found a ball. Gosh, the noise is that you're, it's like an alien dissection. Oh man, oh. 
That's good, isn't it? Man. You're right though. It's a lot like the second one. I'm, I, which I gave an eight to. This is not better than that. It's exactly, exactly the same as according to my recollection. So I'm also giving it an eight, which I think is gonna become my new 10. You know I think the consistency of that is better. So I'm giving this an eight, which I think is my highest so far. Three, two, one. Blue Bunny. Hagen Dazs. I think Blue Bunny's not a good ice cream. Really? Yeah, that's my hunch, but I can't okay. say for sure. All right, never had it, wouldn't know. Round six. All right, last one. I'm gonna try to be, I'm gonna try to have manners for this one. You know, I've, I've learned a lot of lessons throughout this process. I'm gonna try to do this in a, the most defi uh, refined way possible. Oh God. This, my friends, is the crappiest ice cream of all of them that we have tasted this morning. It's not bad, unless you've had all the other ones that we've had this morning. Do you agree? It's definitely not a contender for the best. It's definitely the worst in my mind. Mm. I mean, the taste is just blah. I'm giving it a four. <clears throat> hmm. It has a little bit of that artificial quality that I was talking about with the previous one. Um, it's very mild. It's not just, a bad consistency. Yeah, it's it's creamy. Um, I'll, I'll give this one a four as well. Again, I'm not saying it's bad. I'm just saying it's the worst. Do you know what it is? Yeah, definitely. <laughs> Three, two, one. Dryers. That guy who says that he didn't rip off Briars, but we know he did. I've read the Wikipedia, and I still don't believe it. Okay, can you we can take, take our blindfolds your, off? Yep, take your blindfolds off. Uh, okay. Who do you I hope you we're feel? right about dryers, because we were certainly mean to them at the end, it, especially me, maybe. Yeah, no, yeah don't, don't bring me into that. I, if I was that wrong, I will apologize. Who do you feel won this game? Uh, I honestly was, it was a complete shot in the dark every single time. Link seemed to have some confidence with his guesses, but he but said you know that what before, that and, he's, and he's been bad. <laughs> so. Uh, I think okay. Rhett won, but <laughs> I don't think he deserves it. Link, you got three correct. What? That's incredible. Yeah, I feel you good. You got three correct? You got... But Rhett. Yeah. You got one correct. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Yay! Right, the last one, So apparently. let's bring out that crown for so Link. So that makes me the ice cream king. And yes, your yes. favorite ice cream. Ice cream for everyone. With a total of 16 points is Ben and Jerry's. Ben and Jerry's. Was Link right about that one? No. No. He wasn't he was right not. about that one. And your second favorite was Hagen dazs And your least favorite was Dryers. Dryers. Yeah. Okay. We did it. Hey, there was, there was some logic there. It's amazing what one letter change will do. It'll make your ice cream suck. All right. Now you know what you should be eating. Mm, we're going to be. <laughs> We're You're be, welcome. We're gonna eat some more stuff in Good Mythical More, I believe. But thank you for liking, commenting, and subscribing. You know what time it is. Hi, I'm Amy Hauser from St. George, Utah, and I'm here at the famous Ben and Jerry fac Ben and Jerry's factory in Vermont. And it's time to spin the wheel of mythicality. It's easy to get distracted by that ice cream. Yeah. Click through to watch us try some of Los Angeles' weirdest ice cream flavors, mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, including black olive and goat cheese. And to see where the will of mythicality lands in Good Mythical More. Shield your eyes from summer blues with these mythical sunglasses available at mythical.store.